What's up, you too? So guys, so finna uh, help somebody do the PM at this uh, Piggly Wiggly that I uh, said needed parts. Got three condenser fan motors and fuses, and then we got like an uh, inch and three eighths uh, clamp that we need to put on for one of the lines. But me, I got a little small call, so I'm very easy. And I gotta take pictures of a uh, broken glass door. So I'm gonna take pictures, um, get the model and serial number off the door, get all that good little stuff, and then uh, send it in. Uh, so parts guy can order a door. So I uh, might end up doing something else uh, uh, today. So we're gonna see. But when I get these pictures and stuff, I'm gonna get all this quick. Then I'm going to move them old motors out so when the other tech come in, we can just go in and drop them in. Um, I think it should be about like an hour away. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you got to get gas, all that little stuff, load up the motors and all that. So I should have everything out before you get here. So everything can run smooth. You can get out of here, go on to the next job. Uh, if y'all tuning in and y'all haven't subscribed, I hope y'all consider subscribing. No, thank y'all. Guys, so this is the door right here. They don't know how it got broken. She said the cameras don't work on this owl. Uh, we'll see though, what's about it. First glass pane is seen to be broke. I like these doors because they are easy, pretty easy. To adjust the tension, you just turn this uh, tension bar right here. So real easy. Some of them have uh, a tension block right here where you can put a flat head and turn it. Or they got a tension in here at the door where you have to tension it up in here. But anyway, this is the door right here on ice cream. So usually serial numbers usually be on the top side or the bottom side uh, with, I believe this has been case, the serial number for the door right here. So right there. And also make sure you get the case serial number, which I already did on the bottom side. Hey guys, that was just a quick video. Just had to get some numbers off the door. Um, check what type it is. Uh, make sure you get the serial number off the door. Make sure you get the model serial number off the case. Make sure you know which side uh, the handle is on. It will save you time. That's, and uh, on a later run, that has scared me. Um, but that's pretty much it. Um, hope y'all enjoyed the video. Uh, nothing too crazy. Uh, like I said, we don't know how the door got busted. That camera on the owl did not work. So. That's pretty interesting. So we don't know what had caused it. I don't know if somebody hit a buggy in the cart really hard. Was it a customer? Was it a um, staff? I don't know. So the first pain broke until somebody had to hit that thing in hard, pretty hard. But I'm glass door is pretty durable, but they can break. They can break pretty easy now. And I love changing out glass doors and all that. It's pretty easy. I love changing them out. Um, the only doors I hate is probably the Kaiser Warren. Like if the tension rod go out on them bad boys, it's like a nightmare getting those in. They're not bad, but it's just a nightmare compared uh, to, I believe, husband that have them blocks. And you get to change the rod, push it in, put the door back on. So, well, I think it's that type of door that got the tension rod. Yeah, that type of door that I just showed y'all. With a rod, you adjust at the bottom, you just pull that rod out and then slap another one in. But the Kaiser Warren and all that, you gotta move a plate, you gotta do all that extra stuff just to get what you need to get. Um, that's pretty much it. Let me know if y'all had to change doors. Um, let me know which one uh, is y'all favorite uh, case company. 
that y'all like changing doors on, rather it's Kaiser Warren, Hussman, Zero Zone, um, Hill Phoenix. Y'all let me know what cases y'all like uh, best. Hill Phoenix, I believe, I think at Walmart got some. They case is pretty easy too. You just pop them doors like some soda cans. But anyway, that's gonna be it. I'll see y'all. Uh, be safe.